back to the Sales Family YouTube page. Thank you for tuning in. Today, as you can see, we will be reviewing our choice of stroller, which is the Nuna Mix stroller, as well as the bassinet. The Nuna Mix stroller is a newborn ready stroller. You do not need the bassinet, but we decided to get the bassinet. So why not tell you about it? There are some things that we don't like about the Nuna, so stay tuned to the end, and I will tell you what are our cons of the stroller that we don't really like. suspension Nuna really thought about that and this stroller is great for city walks and on terrain baby will barely feel the bumps and will have a great smooth ride the wheels in the back are 12 inches and the wheels in the front are 8 inches they do go 360 and you can lock them in when you need to um, these are foam filled and it gives the features and feels of a air tire just without all the maintenance. This is also a flip flop friendly brake. Um, just that locks it in really well. And then you just take it in. That's that. Now moving on up. Now we go into the basket. This basket is great. It comes down, it's accessible. Um, it has like this pocket where you can put stuff in. And it also has a divider. So you can divide your stuff if you want to. Or you can put it down and use the whole basket. It's really big. Um, great accessibility from the back and also the front so no matter which way baby is facing you're able to get to the basket and whatever you need from in there oh this stroller um could be real face rear facing and also forward facing and what i love is that nuna put the buttons to turn it around and let go right here on the sides it with like a handle so I often turn this around um, with the baby inside, which I can definitely show you is not hard at all. Um, and I just turn it around in the middle of thing in the middle of our walk instead of me having to take the baby out and then flip it. I literally just press these two buttons, pick it up, and turn it and click it right back in, and it goes in nice and smoothly. It's really not that hard. I don't need to do all these extra things just to flip it if I see that she wants to look out instead of looking at me, which her being a lot older, she doesn't want to look at me as much. She wants to look more out, which is great. All right, so some features about this seat before we get into all the nitty gritty is that it is from birth to 50 pounds and is 45 inches in height. I will show you what I mean by birth um, in just a bit, but that is the size, weight recommended, and the height recommendation. So I brought along my little assistant, my seven month old, to demonstrate how easy and great and smooth Nuna has thought about this buckle. This belt buckle is a non-rethread, and I will show you what I mean in just a second. Five-point harness, and show you what I mean. So you take this, and you put it in through here. Here, you want to play with this? and you buckle this in right in here and you just pull this down and it fits perfectly to your baby. Do the same thing on the other side and you just press this button to release it. Nice and easy. 
and you don't have to take her out or take your baby out to re-thread it and do all of that stuff. You just pull it and it re-threads to their height, to their liking, exactly how it's supposed to be, which is something I absolutely love. Anything that's easy with a baby is a yes for us, right? Yes, yeah. Um, this footrest comes all the way up and it goes all the way down just by pressing the two buttons on the side. These two buttons, you press it and you bring it up and you bring it down. This is a full recline stroller. You just pull this lever back here up and you recline it back all the way back. And it does have one, two, three, three positions. In the beginning when I said that this is a newborn ready shoulder, it is because of simply this. And Nuna really, really thought about this feature, which is amazing and it's great. I definitely used it when she was a baby. So you just take the lever, you pull it all the way back because babies should be laid flat. Newborn should be flat. You take this and you put it up. You take these two things and you unbutton it and you bring it up to the side right here and you button it in and it makes a bassinet like Stroller. This is why you do not need the bassinet. And you have a bassinet type environment here for your baby, which is great. And Nuna really thought about this stroller and all its features. And I really like this feature alone that you're able to make a bassinet type environment for your child. So this is why it it's made or is said to be a newborn ready stroller you don't need anything extra also put in another feature which is really great for our hot hot um climate that we have here in florida and it is that you could take out this liner which is machine washable and what you get back here is a great mesh that lets in a lot of airflow for those really, really hot summer days. Or if you live in a climate where it is hot more than it is cold, which is exactly what we deal with here in Florida. We deal with a lot more hot days than cold days. So this extra feature for our baby when we take her on those really hot summer walks is a great feature and one thing that nuna really thought about within this whole entire stroller is about the fact of airflow ample amount of airflow coming into this stroller to make sure that the babies don't overheat wherever you now are moving up a little bit more up to the canopy which was also very greatly thought about hey First, I'm going to start that. They have this visor that you can take off or leave on. And if you decide to leave it on, you can pop it in if you like or take it out. The canopy does extend, but if you don't want to extend it, um, there is a peekable window that is magnetic. So you magnetic here and here so you don't hear that loud velcro sound while the baby is sleeping they also have that you can bring this up and reveal extra airflow if the baby needs it and to my liking i can also see her if she's facing forward um looking out I can still see her a lot better from here. And it also, if it's really hot, but it's sunny and I need this down, she has a lot of air just coming in through all sides of this stroller. 
this stroller the canopy does extend which I love that it has this extension like this. You just unzipper it and you pull it down. And look how much it just hides your baby. So much. And on the sides, it has more airflow, more mesh on both sides. And this canopy the just extends really long. It hides your baby from the side while they're sleeping. You can pull this all the way back. So even with it laying back, your baby is hidden away from the sun. And again, if you don't want this visor, you can pull this back or bring it forward or just take it off entirely. This also has three levels for the handlebar. You just push these two buttons right here on the side and it goes up three levels so this is the highest level which is really high um this is the second level and this is the third level even at the third level um it is still really comfortable the handlebars is real leather and so is the belly bar as well this belly bar does come off and you can get extra accessories on the nuna website like a snack tray and a cup holder whatever it may be all right so last but not least about this stroller which fun fact my it is the the reason why my husband picked the show this stroller over the upper baby and it's the folding the folding is so easy it folds very compact and it fits really nicely in our small cars what happened she obviously has a lot to say about it so let me just show you this can be folded no matter which way the seat faces and i will show you both ways how it folds with the seat so what you do is you pull this lever back here forward i don't think that's right <laughs> And then you pull this up, both of these up, you helping me? And then you bring this down. What I really like about this is that you can pick this up and roll around with it. Which is great, especially if you're taking it in and out of the car or in the airport. Take it and roll it back up. You just pull this black lever right here. Pull the handle up. Back. Pull this lever. And you just pull it back. Just like that. Now to do it with the opposite way. How I do it is I pull this all the way back. Pull that lever. These two levers again. Push it up. Move it back, flat. Again, you can just pull it around like this. Like that idea? <laughs> Again, to open it, pull this lever, bring up, and you're ready to stroll. So that is my review on the Nuna Mix. Now, I promised you in the beginning that I was gonna tell you some cons. And my number one con is that this does not come with a rain cover. I don't know when or who thought that adding, not adding a rain cover was a good idea, but I personally don't think it's a good idea to not add a rain cover because that is that is really important, especially when you're buying any kind of stroller. Um, having a rain cover is really important is really important um and i really think that they should add that uh, personally i think they should add a rain cover um but who knows maybe nuna would do it later on or maybe not but i really do think that the rain cover is something that's really 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 important um yep yeah, that's it that's 
That's my review on this stroller. We absolutely love it. The only thing, like I said, is the ring cover. Before I move on to the bassinet, I just have one more thing. The Nuna stroller, the Nuna mix does come with the ring adapter to the Nuna um, car seats. And I will review the car seat in another video, which the car seat I absolutely love. And it's, it's a really great car seat. Um, and you just hook this onto it and you take the car seat and just put it right on it. And it comes with the car seat adapter included into the box. So you don't have to buy it separate. All right, so as I stated before, you do not need to get the bassinet. But one of the main reasons why we decided to get the bassinet is because the bassinet does hook into the frame of the stroller. So my idea was that I needed one, a bassinet near my bed. Um, and two, I wanted to be able, if the baby's still sleeping and I was home alone, but the, the dog needed to go outside for a walk, I didn't need to wake up the baby to give him his walk at the time that we set for him. I just could have, I just can unhook this and put it on to the stroller um, frame. And I will show you just now how to do that. So the bassinet to take it off of the bassinet stand is these two um, levers right here and you just pull it up and you can hook it right into the stroller stand like this and walk with the baby just like that. And you don't have to wake her up and do any extra stuff. So that was the main reason why we decided to buy it. And I also needed something by our bed um, because the baby sleeps by our bed. I don't wanna her to be away, so yeah. So I'm gonna start with the base. And the base is really simple. Um, to fold up the base, you just pull these up and you fold it. And it folds up really nice and small to open it nice and simple just pull this down it does have storage space on the bottom and it has three separate sections which we do use we um usually have like extra diapers extra wipes some cloths when she was younger we just had everything we needed that i needed for the nighttime right in here and I didn't have to get up and do extra stuff. My husband didn't have to get up and do extra stuff. We just had all the extra necessities down here, extra clothes, diapers, wipes, bibs, everything right in here. Now going to the bassinet. The bassinet is certified sleep. So this bassinet is certified for overnight sleep, which is great. And the height of it is also amazing because we do have a very high bed. So this pretty much snuggles right up to the side of my bed. And I don't have to do any too much like overreaching or whatnot. So it's great that it sits really high. Um, the pad is really good, very comfortable because that is something that concerns me usually that like the pad is too thin or uncomfortable but it is pretty comfortable at least she likes it she sleeps great in it um it does have a breathable mesh on the side and this also zips off and it's machine washable i have washed this a couple of times and it fits right back on there's no like hassle i just went up along with the the machine washable instructions this is a cool feature it has a, a cool um pocket here and i do leave some stuff in here sometimes um nuna also put in this visor that it, you can take off and put on if you want sit in here a cool feature that they have on their car seat that they also put in their bassinet 
is called a dream drape. So underneath here, there is this little... comes down and while they're in here outside when you're taking a stroll it will block off any sun that's in there and then you just put it back in and hide it away underneath here it is advised to use only up to six months but she really loves it and she does great inside of here and just lays down. Um, I pretty much do when she's awake, so I just catch it. This does go down. You just push these two buttons right here. And you bring it down. Hi. And then you could bring it up, right? Going towards the back. If you need extra airflow while outside, you can bring this all the way up and I can see her. Even at night, this is great because she does get really hot and sweaty. Hi, how are you? And it just gives her so much airflow, so much, a lot of air. She doesn't get too hot at night and she just, she loves it. Just bring it right back down, right? Peekaboo! Peekaboo! She's not looking. Hi! Peekaboo! Hey. It's really long. She is kind of short and tiny, but that's okay. But it is a long bassinet. And she loves it. You want to sit up? So we will be using it until I feel like she can't fit in it anymore, but she still fits in it and it's great. I love it. Nuna did a really good job thinking about their products. And as you can see, we're at Nuna family. Last thing, this bassinet is extremely portable. It literally takes like seconds to break down and set up. And I will show you how. So in the back down here, you press these two buttons in and those these two pop out and then inside of here inside of here there's two more buttons for the front and the back to pop out once these pop out just like that Pop it out and it lays flat and you can take this right with you just like this. We have taken it with us to New York City and put it in our trunk along with the stroller and our suitcases, stuff for the dog, a whole bunch of stuff inside of it in my tiny little trunk and it fit perfectly. It, was, it did not take too much space. I even fit it in with the bassinet stand, which you don't need to, but I wanted to have her at a heightened level with me in my mom's house, so it worked perfectly. And I just set it up literally in two seconds. Like, I click these in, push these out, And it was all set so this bassinet is great it, you could take it with you leave it at home extremely portable and it's great and this little one show her hi these two it's time for a nap right say thank you for tuning in yeah and we will see you again like subscribe and comment and let us know what you would like to see next. Say bye. Say thank you. Yeah, thank you. All right, my two little helpers. Thank you, bye.